Hi, my name is Mike Enriquez, and I'm the author and presenter of the Toughest Stuff CT Registry Review Seminar. Now, today's Some Things to Know lecture is a windowing lesson. And here's the problem. Calculate the range of Hounsfield units presented when window level is 50 and the window width is 200. It's important to note that the window level value is the midpoint of the window width value of 200. To explain what's going on with this, let's look at the scale. When we look at the scale here, we see we have plus 2,000 Hounsfield units representing bone at the top and those structures that are very difficult to penetrate. In the middle, we have zero Hounsfield units representing water. The range is actually plus four to minus four. And then down at the bottom, we have minus 2,000 Hounsfield units representing those structures like air that are easy to penetrate. So now, when we look at our problem to calculate the range of Hounsfield units presented when window level or window center is 50 Hounsfield units and the window width is 200 Hounsfield units, take a look at the middle portion right here. Here's where we are at plus 50 Hounsfield units, plus 50 up from zero. And the problem is the uh, window width is 200, which means that on the scale, we'll be at a point that will be plus 100 plus 50 and minus 100 from plus 50. When we add 100 to plus 50, we get 150 positive units, which is the top of the range. And then when we subtract 100 units from plus 50, we get minus 50 Hounsfield units representing the bottom of the range. That means that the answer to our problem is going to be right here, 150 to minus 50, as far as the range of Hounsfield units represented as the answer to the problem. Let's take a look at the hyper solution. Since 100 is one half of the window width value of 200, we are going to add 100 to the window level value of positive 50, which equals positive 150 and establishes the top of the range. And then we will subtract 100 from positive 50. That will equal negative 50, which establishes the bottom of the range. So there you have it. The problem of calculating the range of Hounsfield units is solved, and the answer is 150 to negative 50. Well, thank you so much for your time and attention. If you need additional help in your preparation for the CT registry exam, go to www.radprof.com and check out my online on-demand webinar, which is approved for 16 Category A CE credits and satisfies the ART structured education requirement. Have a great day. Bye now.